Hey, how's it going? Welcome to A Trip in the South. Welcome to a Target haul. So I just came off of a small vacation and we went to Dallas, Texas, where I stopped at not one, not two, but I'm pretty sure three or four Targets. And let me show you what was in their clearance section. So if you're new here, hi, I'm Elisa. I love Target. I love shopping, but I have three kids and a husband and a mortgage. So clearance shopping it is. Um, in real life, I love to stay between the six and under, but if there's some really good things, I will go a little bit above. And you will see some of that in this haul today. So usually I take all the bags out and just show you the real stuff. So I'm trying to do this really swiftly, deep into nap time. Okay, so let's get into it. The first thing that I got are these really cute art class sandals for next summer. I thought they were super cute. These are originally $15 and I got them for $7.50. So 50% off and they're super like smushy. Love that. Um, this is actually something we were supposed to use in the car and I completely forgot, but they're doodle boards. It's kind of like an etch-a-sketch in a way, um, but they were on, in the dollar spot for a dollar, so I got some of those, so that'll be for like our next trip. Gum, because you need it. Um, I got these watches for the girls. These are normally $8, so these were five sixty, so 30% off. If you can see that, it's Encanto, and then we got a mermaid so that was cute i opened my car and this sweet little piggy bank fell and hit the ground which i'm kind of sad about but i haven't seen plastic piggy banks in such a long time this was three dollars from dollar spot like it cracked wide open but i just thought that that would be super cute the girls have automatic ones but honestly i need a little piggy bank so i was just gonna use that to place in the drawer that was three bucks um we are in our flash card phase and sometimes those little boxes that they come in they get torn or i put them in ziploc bags and i feel like as soon as i put them in a ziploc bag they get lost so i bought this little container um for a dollar i was going to use that for my five-year-old she is reading and i found the best way to partner with her reading is going through word flashcards um so she, she can be familiar with more words so also from the dollar spot this little lazy susan i don't know what i'm going to put in this yet but we have some in for our spices above our stove um but you can put anything in the lazy susan and i'm going to i'm going to use it for something but this was five dollars okay so jammed um, for some reason, we don't have any summer jams for our girls. I don't know why, but we don't. Um, they are really loving Wish. So I found this cute little set. Normally $14. And I don't... So it's got them for 7 which is a little pricey. But it's cute, so I said, we need it. We're going to go for it. For me... If y'all know me, y'all know that I have literally this skirt in every single wash. And they came out with this white a little later in the game. It has a split in the back. It's universal thread. Super cute. This is normally $28. I got it for $19.60. It's a little high. But like I said, they came out with this late. And when I tell you, I have only I went to at least four stores that I only saw this twice. And this was in my size. So I had to buy it. Um, these cute little rompers, workout rompers for the girls. So this is normally $20 and I got it on sale for six. I just think that is adorable. Check out those bags. Okay. We also got some All In Motion flared leggings. These were originally 16. I got these for eight, so 50. Y'all know I love these little tennis dresses, so I finally was able to get one for the girls. This cute little light blue. 
It's normally on uh, on sale for well, it's normally eighteen dollars. It was on sale for twelve sixty, but I got it for ten eighty. So I went ahead and got it. It has a little shorts under it. Here's another little romper situation that I think is really cute. Um, the back is absolutely adorable. Um, it sells for twenty. Was on sale for six bucks. And I love that color. Um, on the same front is the jams. Even though it's a thicker material, it's short sleeve. So we like to keep it cold. This is normally $10 and I got it on sale for five. And then we got this purple one because that's my daughter's favorite color. And then we have more cards, like I told you about flashcards. So these are the ones that you can actually make sentences with, but I'm just gonna use them once again, just as flashcards. Like we can get into sentence development, but now we have more words. Um, and then same thing, more, more actual words. Um, I really like these. Think about what these at the beginning of the summer. They're like the adhesive pockets. You can put pictures and stuff in them. This is what they use them for on the back. And then I picked up another skirt. It's uh, the raw hem. This is the longest one. This is once again, universal thread. This was normally for sale for $36 and I got it for 18 in this beautiful dark wash. And then this other thing that I think just hit the line, I think it was return, is this, you see how heavy this is? This is a denim dress. Um, dark wash, normally 32, got it for 22, but it's super heavy. This is Fair Trade Certified Factory. I don't know what that means, but I'm hoping that that means that good people have made this. Um, it has pockets, and this is one of those pieces that like I will have forever. I won't get rid of. Um, like when it is time, when I'm losing weight, I'm gonna get it taken in because it's such good quality. Um, and I'm learning that just because it's not really in style right now doesn't mean that it won't come back and that I should not get rid of it. So that is my quick little haul of going to four targets in the Dallas, Texas area. See you later.